some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I received a rather unusual request. The other day I was lurking around other people's live streams just to see what was going on. I was just so bored. And thus I ended up on Vegas Valley Joe's uh, live stream. When a frauditor noticed that I was in there, they had a particularly unusual request for me. The frauditor in question asked me to do a video for them. In this case, it was reviewing one of their own videos. So I said, sure, uh, do you have a video in mind that you would like me to look at? She said, no, nah, go ahead and surprise me. So I said, sure, it might take me a couple days to get to you, but I'll do it. Now with that being said, just because I agreed to do a video of you doesn't mean I will take it easy on you either. So today I looked at a sampling of your video library and I have some critiques. So let's all sit back, relax, and enjoy me tearing apart News Now Lisa's channel. It's your girl, News Now Lisa. Hey, I just want to tell you how nasty the city of Miami is. Remember David? Yeah, I, I gave him that blanket and the piss in the bottles, the holy bibles and the piss have been sitting there for about a week. Okay, Lisa, you wanted to hear my satirical review of one or more of your videos? Well, here you go. Some of your videos are like watching a bottle of stale piss, which is why I chose this video as one of the examples. It is great that you're trying to help the homeless in Miami, Florida, but why aren't all your cop-watching videos this high quality? Don't worry, we'll get to a couple of them here in a minute. I'll show you things that I need to point out to you. Those are all the bags that I brought them. Look, those are the food. That's the food that I brought them. I thought he had a bag over here. Yo, it's a pillow. It's a pillow. I thought he had a bag over here. His bag is back there. See, there's a bag back there. Get out of there, boy. In the city of Miami is still just leaving this here, and David has been gone for a long time. Those are all the food bags that I bought him, or brought him. Pokemon card. Wait. <gasps> I hope that's not the Pokemon card from my, from my truck. Oh, it's not. It's not, but it's cool. But yeah, that's pretty messed up. Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe, like, and share. Remember, David, I'll leave a link in the comments. Get away from it, boy. Okay, let's go on to the next sampling of her library. It's your girl. News now, Lisa. Hit that thumbs up. And this guy refused to take my report. The Miami Police Department. How the hell did they refuse to take your report? All I see here are a couple cops doing their jobs. I mean, if you're going to want to be an auditor, at least show something. Show, don't tell. Then use your words to interpret what's going on. Oh yeah, by the way... Invest in a better camera, will ya? If you can. Real sickos. Trying to make a report. Uh, for one, that girl just porn bombed me. So I'm gonna do a fight. That girl just. Oh, so you're not gonna take my report? Do you know that I have an educational channel and she. Kids watch my channel and she just porn bombed me? Put her breast on there, you're not gonna take my report? Another great example of show, don't tell. If someone like that interferes in one of your videos, show it. Don't tell it, otherwise nobody will believe you. You better hope they ain't. To watch you violate people's rights, you hope they ain't, huh? Minding my business? This is my business. This is, this is my business. I'm a news... I, I am the business. 
did you notice he can't even look at me and he's like running away from me? Oh yeah, he was real scared of you. He was trembling his boots, don't you see it? It's not like he didn't have somewhere else to be, like on another call. Basically what happened was I got porn bombed. This big girl pulled her shirt up and showed her boobs right on my live. Right here in Miami, Oklahoma. And here comes a train right now. Two longs, one short, one long. Hit that thumbs up. It's your girl, News Now Lisa. Have you subscribed yet? What are you waiting for? It's free! Free. You ain't even gonna subscribe. That's fine. It's all good. It's all good. And there's another issue in there that I will resolve here in a moment. But let's get on to the final video. Not recording in here. It's your girl. News now, Lisa. Uh, oh, you're his, you're his supervisor? Why ain't that a shame? How did you let them do that to me the other day if you're his supervisor? You don't know what I'm talking about? I got you on camera standing right next to him. I need to make a complaint on Mullins, you, and the other guy. I need three. Three. I want three. I'm asking for three. He's giving one. What's your name and badge number? Uh, do you know that Mullins looked me up illegally? You, you, you heard me the other day. You said something about my warrant? Mm -hmm. So how, how would we know about my warrant? I, you guys have not, I've never mm -hmm. identified. You don't know, well, we're gonna find out. You know there's ways of finding out, right? We'll find out. Okay, we will find out because this is illegal. Yeah, that guy's a hothead. You let him sit there and keep arguing with me and escalate. No, from what I've seen of a lot of frauditors, it's you guys that like to escalate, even when you're preaching about de-escalation, you're actually escalating. You remember me, right? Yeah, didn't you do the walk of shame with me? I didn't do a walk of shame. You didn't? No. You want the guy telling me to go over here and go over there, stand back? And I was like, get off my shit, right? Yeah! He didn't do the walk of shame. I will put it in the comments, guys. The walk of shame. He's refusing to give me three. You're probably wondering what just happened. Well... Mullins 220 or was it 221? I don't remember. This is Mullins supervisor Bissell 512. Here's a perfect example of cops love to lie. Bissell says he didn't do the walk of shame, but that's my claim to fame. I'm gonna put in the comments a link to the walk of shame that's right in the comments will be a link to the walk of shame have you subscribed yet did you hear that in that video well i certainly did all those long pauses in the commentary that you did something like this for more than a few seconds, generally makes for a very boring video. If you have a computer, get yourself the program Audacity at the very least. It will help you out with those long pauses when you're editing your commentary into your videos. I use it all the time. Well, that's the end of my critique slash reviews of some of your videos that you requested. I hope you enjoyed them. And if you didn't, Lisa, it's not my fault. The blame lies within the material, not I. In fact, Chris Cordova would say, do better. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed satire. And for anybody who's watching this video, if you like her material, do what you want. Rate, comment, subscribe on her channel, whatever you want to do. I don't care. In fact, I'll have a link in the description to her channel if that's what you want to do.